was requested to cover Arbitrum today, the airdrop. But there was some conflict amongst the communities. Basically what happened was Arbitrum, after however many months and months and months of operating, building, you know, covering their own expenses, launched their own governance token. So for people that qualified that were using testing and helping build Arbitrum network into what it was, this is a layer two solution for Ethereum, uh, or what it is, they were included in the Arbitrum airdrop. So it's a DAO. It's a big leap forward bringing in decentralization. Uh, you can control the protocol upgrades or you've got to vote. The funds allocation and election for a security council who can perform emergency upgrades. So this would be like a centralized entity or team of people that can make choices based upon you know what they need to do very quickly. Some of the issue that came up was that they started selling these tokens very quickly to cover expenses. So this is where it wasn't really put to a vote. They said that it was already you know put through before anyone had a chance to vote. And that's where it's like, well, what's the point of having a token to vote if the vote doesn't count? It was basically resolved by them pulling it back and no longer doing that. I am very interested in seeing how this is going to work out. So users across the ecosystem will be given um, basically 11.62% of the tokens. So this is where you know 11.62% isn't a lot. There's gonna be a lot that are coming out with airdrops, my one word of caution is buy the rumor, sell the news. You're likely going to make way better gains trading than you are on the airdrop and typically trying to sell that airdrop if you're trying to offload immediately, uh, so is everyone else, right? So free coin, uh, easy come, easy go. And that's where, I mean, Uniswap, it started at three bucks, I think, and it went up 800% or more. So you can always buy back on the low. There's people that make full time. I mean, the Arbitrum airdrop, there was multiple people that made a million dollars plus just from using different wallets, different setups. So it's, it's possible. You figure out how to game the system, you can really make some good money. <laughs>